over there. You want to see a show? This is what I have to offer. I got to experience the ultimate high and the ultimate low all in one day. The low of missing the game-winning shot game seven to go on to the conference finals. Regardless of if you hate me, you think I can't play, I can play, man. I, I, I just know I can play. I know I belong here. With the fifth pick in the 1998 NBA draft, the Golden State Warriors select Vince Carter from the University of North Carolina. I'd like to announce a trade. Toronto has traded the rights to Antoine Jameson to Golden State for the rights to Vince Carter. Vince, tell me how excited you are about playing in Toronto. <laughs> I'm excited. I had a great workout out there, and I'm really looking forward to it. Now, this guy's a big buzz up north, no doubt about it. Thanks to the former UNC Tar Heel, basketball has begun to mean something in Canada. Carter, of course, a big reason why the Raptors may be headed to the playoffs. Carter won the award, the NBA Rookie of the Month, in March. So Vince Carter may not be bigger than the CN Tower, but the rookie phenom is pretty darn close. Carter's first season was one long highlight reel as he earned the Schick Rookie of the Year award. My favorite is um, the one when he dunked on the top of him. Um, he just smashed it down on him. Carter, heads up. Oh, 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 oh. And listen to the crowd. <laughs> wow. Vince Carter's doing dunks that Dr. J used to do, but, you know, making it look even better. Dunk contest is something that I've always wanted to do. I took the dunk contest serious. Like, I felt like it was a playoff approach as far as I'm coming here focused, I'm trying to win. All right, here is Vince Carter with his first stop. I said I want to be in the dunk contest because I watched it, I studied it. This was that ultimate golden dream as being in the dunk contest. I was like, it's over for everybody because I'm in my zone now. Contest, the biggest night of my life. Here comes Carter and puts it down. Ben Carter to win the NBA.com Slam Dunk 2000 Championship. I wasn't afraid to fail. 94 92. Carter wide up for the win. He is invincible. Two seconds. One second. Beats the buzzer. Now it's the I felt like I wanted to show the world what I could do. Big time shot, stepping up huge with a three-pointer. Look out! Soaring from the air, Vince Carter with the greatest of ease. If I ask you one question to fill in the blank, when it's all said and done, at the end of my career, I want people to say that he made a difference on the court and off the court mentally, not just physically. I don't want you to just to label me as Vince Carter the dunker, but he could do a lot of things, and that's kind of where my focus was. Talk about you going to Canada. What was your first thoughts? To my surprise, it's one of the best kept secrets. I mean, it's one of the best places ever. I mean, it, they were learning with me. The Raptors with the ball, two seconds to go. Toronto out of timeouts. They've got Del Curry in down in the ball. They're going to set screens for Vince Carter coming to it. Curry has it. Carter trying to get free. Carter at the buzzer. No go. And the Sixers hold on and advance to the conference finals. As it turns out, it's that left Achilles again. He said he felt it pop when he just aggravated it when he was jumping. It was just frustrating. We would win the game and come home and still felt like we got blown out. The rumblings of Vince Carter wants out. The Raptors want to trade Vince Carter. It was rather frustrating for me to, to hear that and to, uh, to really understand and grasp it. So it was like, oh, Vince didn't work or well, want to be here and so on and so forth. Just the hatred. I just couldn't understand it. You could tell with Vince that if it's going to be like this, 
you know, I don't want to be here. I don't want to duck anymore. Why not? For what? So the main source of sports entertainment in Canada these days is generally Raptors basketball, and all-star Vince Carter in particular, but not anymore. A Friday trade sent to Air Canada to the Nets for Alonzo Mourning, two other players. I'm just going to step in and knock down open shots and get a couple of dunks here, man, and we'll see what happens from there. I just wanted to prove to, to everyone, like, I still got it. I'm still capable. I'm still able to play this game. I don't think any player has ever been booed like that night. From North Carolina, 6'6", guard number 15, Vince Carter. Well, it's been a remarkable turnaround for Vince Carter, especially when you consider his last few years in Toronto. But he left it all behind when he was traded to New Jersey. Kid, three seconds. Carter looking for the win. He buries it. What he's done over the past few months may just top them all. Leading the Nets on a dramatic run to a playoff berth. I've never, ever not played 100%. For the people that know me, they know I will never, ever disrespect a game like that. Vince Carter, Michael Jordan, and yourself. In the prime, who wins a dunk contest? Uh, Vince. Alonzo Mourning changing a shot. This lead of eight, Miami's largest of the game, but talk about large. How about that slam dunk from Vince Carter? Well, Vince is a special dunk, and, uh, you know, the way Vince dunks the ball was unbelievable. Is there a way to stop him from that? No, man. If, if there was, we would have did it. Let me tell you something. I love you, dog. Okay, I love you too. Hold on. I never look, told look. you that. I love you, man. <laughs> Come downtown! Oh! How do you explain your tremendous increase in production all of a sudden. You know, we have a, a hell of a point guard who makes my job easier. You got Jason Kidd who makes everybody better. He makes Vince Carter a lot better. Three seconds left. Carter with two seconds. Carter for the win. Got it. Vince Carter has done it. I'm still here. I, I, I still love the game. You know, the numbers speak for itself, history speaks for itself, so I leave that to other, you know, I never say, oh, look at the numbers. One of the great games ever turned in by a New Jersey net, and one of the great opponent nights against Miami, and you got to tip your hat and respect the 51-point performance by Vince Carter. I don't, I don't feel comfortable coming here and play, you know, I feel at home. The top trade on draft day, Vince Carter moving on again. I think he's going to have a great year with Orlando. I think he's going to be terrific. Vince Carter to the Phoenix Suns. For their leading scorer, Jason Richardson and Hito Turklu. Whatever you had to say, I'm, I'm, going to show, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. A veteran making his way to Dallas in Vince Carter. Still chasing the elusive championship. Yes! Vince Carter. No, we're trying to get to 20, right? I play the game of basketball because I just love it. Being able to persevere through tough times. They just showed a video tribute of Carter has received a standing ovation. Vince Carter is out to Sacramento and he is doing this one more time around. Why is Vince Carter still playing? Because I love to play, man. Well, this is a good signing for the Atlanta Hawks. Gets it back to him and Vince dunks it for 25,000. I tell you what, it's a huge weight lifted off my shoulder, but man, this is, this is awesome. He changed the culture there in Toronto. You know, how he brought Toronto from being one of the newer teams in the league to, you know, almost going to the finals. I want to be like Vince. Go, baby! Go, baby! Not only am I doing it for the love and what I, you know, I love doing, I do it for the game and respect to the game and the players that played it. When I don't want to put the work in anymore, I, I'm stepping away. I just can't imagine it right now because I still feel like I can go.